Debts have a plan for the renovations, and now they have the money. And as Stephanie Poole found out, they're ready to put both into action. She joins us in the studio with more on their plans. Yes, Andre, over the next couple of weeks, students and staff are rolling up their sleeves to get to work on a long awaited makeover. Chipped paint, old air conditioning units, and a moldy carpet. This is what senior JROTC student Ariel Hatton says she has looked at every day for the last four years. And this room has been through so many changes because at first it was the mechanics room, it was the powerlifting room, it was the cosmetology lab, and that's why we have so many different colors and things going on in here. But little did she know it would all be changing. The Home Depot Foundation awarded Aberdeen High School JROTC program $10,000 to make major upgrades to their classroom. In two weeks, new floorboards, a fresh paint job, and new air conditioning units will all be put in. To see that we're finally getting to rebuild it and put it back together to make it what it should be is very exciting. Before being designated for the JROTC program, Room 25 experienced a lot of wear and tear, leaving the room in an unstable condition. Sergeant Rodney Williams says his cadets came up with designs and colors for the new classroom. Based on when a cadet comes in, they see A1 facilities. They want to be A1. And we tried to um, still in our kids this first semester. Um, we came on this program. We're going to be the flagship of this campus. And to all of be the flagship, you got to be look like you're there. We may not have the best best materials and stuff like some of the top schools have. Well, we're going to take care of our stuff. And with the new look means more positive attitudes. I have no room. It was just like everybody came here all slouched over. You know, it's kind of boring. People really didn't feel like doing any color guard drill or anything, but having this makes people want to thrive to their achievements in this program here. Hatton says she's grateful to leave her mark for those JROTC students who will come after her. It's like leaving a legacy. When people who come here next to us, they look back, they're going to say, oh, my cousin did this, or my brother and my sister did this. They put the floor together. They made the colors. They painted the walls. They did all of that. So we're leaving a legacy behind from all of us. All classroom renovations should be finalized by November 13th.